bit windy. Um, I came from somewhere down there, maybe like down there. I walked up, 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 up. I camped on that black spot last night. Down and then up, 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 up. I just came here, and this is just amazing. Look at that. It's crazy. It's crazy nice. Pyrenees, I am uh, sold. Let's cross this little river without falling into it. I don't really push me as far as I can go in the physical aspect. I try to push my paintings as much as possible. This is the way to paint. Going into nature and just be, you know? First of all, have to let go of your expectations and your fears. You need to sort of accept feeling lost. Well, the other side you have to get comfortable not fully being in control. There's a few mosquitoes here, just a little bit, like a two and a half million or something like that. If you can do it, that's great, because that's how we find it. This is where we come from. From nature. We're part of it. It's not only about going out there and making a painting, it's about exploring, discovering, and getting into the rhythm of nature. It's realizing you're part of something bigger. A dance or a symphony, and to me there's definitely a spiritual aspect to this. There's a big feeling there, almost like you're communicating in a new way with your surroundings. It's the feeling I get from hearing a piano playing. Harmonies, a symphony of sounds in space echoing. It's big, it's grand. There's a mysticism to it. That's what I feel in nature when I'm painting. Being a part of that symphony and you're the echo. Trying to echo what you see and everything around you and also as you are experiencing exactly that. To me that's so important. that my paintings are intentionally something bigger than myself. Who will put themselves out of their comfort zone? Getting lost in the wilderness, maybe even putting their lives on the line sometimes, or at least risk it. I survived the cows. I didn't start screaming at them. I think that's the key. <laughs> that's how you create something bigger. 
This is my dance, my climbing. Following the natural rhythm of what's there. Not trying to be it, but just being part of it as much as possible. And this is the way to do that.